started pouring and suddenly it was just me in a field of cows. And of course we're in Europe, so there are no street signs anywhere and it's getting dark. I think she thought she was in some bad werewolf movie. Stay off the moors, lassie. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, all of a sudden, out of nowhere, Colin comes riding up on horseback. Oh. Can you believe it? A horse. And asks me if I need any help. Wow. Well, you were a lady in distress. What was I going to do? Oh, it's right out of a Bronte novel. Oh. So anyway, he shows me to this charming little inn where he proceeds to buy me the most awful dinner I have ever had in my <laughs> life. Yeah, it was pretty bad, even by Scottish standards. <laughs> <laughs> then we just spent the next month traveling around the country, getting to know each other, visiting museums. It was, it was, it was perfect. perfect. So when it was time for Hannah to leave, I just, I don't know, I just, I couldn't let her go. Huh. So I got down on one knee. And you proposed, and I oh. accepted. Wow, that's just, it's huge, isn't so it? So the wedding's coming together very quickly. Yeah, it sounds like it. We're gonna get married in Scotland at Colin's parents' summer home. It's gonna be a pretty small affair. We can't expect too many people to make the trip overseas in just a fortnight. Fortnight? Yeah. That's two weeks. It's crazy, isn't it? Have you ever been to Scotland, Tom? You know, I haven't. You should see the wee church over exchange. Oh, it's the, the same church that Colin's parents were married in. It's pretty spectacular. It's just across the lock from my distillery. Distillery? Uh, yeah, Colin's family owns the largest whiskey distillery in Scotland. Oh. Tom, look, if you were getting married, I'd expect to be your best man. Uh, Tom, will you be my maid of honor? <laughs> your maid of honor? Oh! What is it with you, man? I, I did. What are you? Excuse me. Excuse me. Do you see that? 